ask you to close your eyes and picture an old Antarctic explorer, you might picture this guy, geologist and explorer Sir Douglas Mawson. He was born in Yorkshire, England in 1882 and moved to Australia when he was two. At uni, he studied geology and engineering. In 1907, Mawson joined English explorer Ernest Shackleton aboard a ship called the Nimrod for his first voyage down to Antarctica. He and Mawson became the first to reach the South Magnetic Pole. A few years later, with a sense of adventure and a taste for the cold, Mawson led the Australian Antarctic Expedition to map the coastline, collect rocks, and make lots of scientific observations. During a big trek inland, disaster struck. Two of Mawson's companions, Belgrave Ninnis and Xavier Mertz, died. For the next 30 days, Mawson trekked alone in the freezing cold which damaged feet and hardly any food, dragging his sled behind him. As he staggered back to camp, Mawson saw his ship, the Aurora, sailing off in the distance. He had missed it only by a few hours. Mawson stayed in Antarctica for another year, collecting scientific data. After this famous journey, Mawson became a lecturer at the Adelaide University and even went back to Antarctica in 1929 and 1931. Today, the Australian Antarctic Station is named after Sir Douglas Mawson and he is remembered for his scientific contributions and his epic tale of survival.